Hey, hello everybody, welcome back to Final Fantasy X. <laughs> Let's carry on. Please. Give us a chance to explain. No need. I already know what I'll tell the other maesters. Meaning? Lord Seymour was the leader of the Guado before becoming a maester. You're not letting us go. Let you go? Lord Seymour would never forgive us if we did. Wait! Wait! Disco's sphere! We can show it to them! You mean this? Ass fight coming up. Uh, uh, trying to get a walk in. You've really done it now. Buy something just in case. <laughs> He's got high potions, but we already have a, uh, a bevy of them. Alright, so you'll see behind us that we're being chased by the Guado. Guado are really fast. Basically, if the guy touches you, you get into a battle. Oh no, here he comes. Yeah, and they can summon creatures. <laughs> I love this boss fight coming up. Everybody that's played this game knows exactly what fight I'm talking about. <laughs> Such a good battle. I just like it because it's it's an unexpectedly strong enemy. But we need to take his potion from him. every time I see it. Some of you guys are gonna know what video I'm talking about. It's a, uh, like an actual fight. Like a fight, like a street fight. Like with real human beings. <laughs> and this guy totally blitzes the hell out of the other guy and uh, keeps uh, uh, kind of shouting at the guy like, you ever go night-night? You ever go night-night? And the guy's like totally snoozing on the floor. <laughs> Wait, wait, wait. 
Holy turns. Wonder why that flan never got his turn. Oh well. I want to make sure that I don't accidentally use that uh, Lux Spear. That would totally suck. So we do not have a uh, Fortune Spear to go along with it. At least I don't think we do. No, we do not. Come on, Orin, you can do it. No, <laughs> you cannot. Good night, Flanny boy. Come on, come on, you can do it. <laughs> I might as well kill the wolf now. Key sphere, nice. Man, another ambush. Magic by four. Very beast. More HP. Oh, so good. Uh, our survival just increased by quite a bit overall. Nice, we got that silence bust. Handsome. Here we go. Yeah, this is such a good boss fight. I love this enemy. So strong. Like, punch the living shit out of you. <laughs> one shot. Like, one punch when to go. Not a hard fight or anything, I just love this. Uh, I just like the creature itself. Oh, here he comes. Oh, no. It's the Wendigo.
<laughs> I'm so glad we dodged that, tell you what. Let's get a lancet from him. Power break. Nope, wrong. <laughs> Swap to Riku. Take his potion. his berserk away from him so he's not so strong if you're wondering what I was doing there. Now we're gonna magic break him. Yeah boy what's up? <laughs> get Riku back. See if we can get something cooler. Another high potion I'm alright with that. Give him a little bit of thunder. She goes where she stops on yellow. Lightning ball. Whoop. Heat it up. Oh yeah. Tough guy, huh? Ball. Oh. Hell yeah. What's up? Oh, miss me, miss me. What is it? You an icy Wendigo doesn't like fire, you guys. Oh, hell yes. Eat this. Nine four 
party. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. I love this. He's like, you bastard. Woogity boogie. Hi. <laughs> and it like destroys the whole lake. Because the whole, the temple is built uh, on a frozen lake. So he just punched the ice through. There's no water underneath the ice though. It's been frozen over for a millennia. Praise be to Yevon. That's what I would have said if I was a follower of Yevon. Hmm. We were all there and in one piece, even if I had a headache from wondering what was in store for us next. Yeah, see, the water down here is only, like, knee-deep because it's just been frozen for so long that, you know, it creates a chasm inside uh, underneath the ice. This game is so amazing. I miss Hironobu Sakaguchi, you guys. I really do. When I heard that he had passed away, oh man, it sucked. It sucked a lot because I, I knew that there would never be, uh, like, another 10 out of 10 Final Fantasy. You know what I mean? Bio, you guys. Yeah, I knew there would never be another uh, perfect Final Fantasy once he uh, passed away. And I was right. I mean, the ones after his death are all right. Nice, Kamari learned haste. We have two people that can do haste now. Uh, but uh, Hironobu Sakakuchi was the soul of this damn game, you know what I mean? Well, look at Warren's HP, you guys. Three, 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 three. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get a game save. All right. We're under the lake ice, aren't we? Yep. Maybe. Look, that's the bottom of the temple. Yep. <sighs> We've fallen a long way. What now, I wonder? What now? Uh, you act first and think later, don't you? I mean, can't you be a little more responsible? We're all depending on you, you know? A lecture. No, no, no. <laughs> Just a suggestion. <laughs> you should place trust in your friends. But you can't expect someone to protect you all the time. You would do well to remember that. Is that a lecture? It's advice. <laughs> Document. <sighs> Hey, Wonka, would you cheer up? I, look, we only did what we had to do. It doesn't matter. Don't you see? I've always walked the path of Yevon. But now, I'm a traitor. How could this happen? Damn! It's not Riku's fault either. <laughs> Poor guy, man. <laughs> it's gonna be alright, big boy. Yuna will wake soon. Kimari knows this. Uh, can I have that treasure box, Kimari? No? <laughs> I'm sure Yuni's okay. She's breathing fine and all. How are Lulu and Waka? Hmm. Well, Waka's in shock. Can't blame him either. <laughs> and Lulu, well, she's just the same as always. Yep, calm, so calm and collected. All grown up, I guess. Tough as nails. I guess. Well, just give me five or six more years. 
So, Kamari, how do we get out of here? <laughs> hey, don't change the subject. We climb. Kimari too. Only those who try will become. <laughs> huh? Straight up. I think he means you have to work hard if you want to be like Lulu. Oh, I will. Kimari think Riku should stay Riku. Huh? Hey, are you saying I'll never be like Lulu? Kimari! <laughs> at a time like this. Uh, Yuna? Like, man, what have we done, you know? <laughs> Shit. The whole world is going to be after I us now. I wanted to confront Maester Seymour about his father, Lord Jisco. I wanted to convince him to turn himself in to Yevon's judgment. In exchange for marriage? Yes, if that's what it took. So, what did Seymour say? He didn't say anything. Now, I, now I don't even think it was worth it. I should have told you what I was going to do. Enough. Dwelling in the past is futile. Hey, you don't have to say it like that. You want to waste time listening to her regrets. You don't have to say it like that. Shit, sure, man. Our immediate concern is Yuna's pilgrimage. Are you willing to go on? Yes. Hell yeah. But then, do you think Yevon will allow it? The Faith are the ones that give power to the summoners. Not the temples or the teachings. Hmm. If the temples try to stop us, then we will defy Yevon if we must. Damn. Whoa! I can't believe you said that! Sir Oren? Look at Kamari smiling. Count me out. We have to atone to make up for the sins we have committed. Of course. It's not like I ever liked Maester Seymour, yeah? No way I'll ever forgive him for killing Lord Jisco. And for trying to do us all in two, you know? But still, the bunch of us going against Yevon? No way! Hmm. But still, we have transgressed and must face our punishment. We must go to Bevel. We must speak with Maester Micah and explain what has happened. There is no other way, I think. I agree. Uh, Sir Oren? Bevel is the largest city in Spirit. So Spira. it is decided. It's absolutely massive. Will you come with us? I am the troublemaker after all. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> you can always count on Oren to complicate things. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, just blame it all on Oren. Kamari roars and Oren runs off. <laughs> <laughs> I never asked you to follow me. Hey, but that's what friends are for. Damn yeah, it, we stick together. Right? We're a, yep. gr we're a group. Team. Thank you. Hell yeah. Huh? Friends, huh? <laughs> Man, how can you all act like nothing's wrong? Must got nerves of steel or something. You're too edgy. Listen to the hymn and calm down. <laughs> Group back together? Is that coming from the temple? Yes, it is Yevon's gift. It soothes the hearts of the faithful. Hmm. Say, you feel something weird in the air. Some kind of bad vibes or something. Yeah. I thought so. Shit's about to get real. Is that singing? The faith. Oh. Huh? The faith? What? It can sing? Of course it can. 
Don't be a fool. What a strange world, this place you know. smell different now. Kimari not know if this good or bad. Everybody on the team is on edge. Level two key sphere. Come here, kitty. <laughs> Friends, huh? Hmm. <laughs> First time a non bed called me that. I'm sure that Maester Micah will listen to us. Yeah, that's a long shot, I think. Jack used to sing this song. <laughs> yeah, over and over. <laughs> but not this good, that's for sure. <laughs> Another trait you share. Uh, what? You were listening? from Xanarkin, are you? You homesick? Maybe. Say, how'd you get to Xanarkin anyway? Sin? Uh-huh. I thought so. That proved it. Sin was the link between Xanarkand and Spira. Which means, if we kill Sin, I'll never be able to go home. Shit, eh? We should get moving soon. Hmm? The singing stopped. My god, it's Sin. Well, there's Sin. It's the first time you ever really get a good look at him. Holy Sin. shit. The toxin, watch out! It was then I knew that Sin really was my old man. For the first time, I was finally able to believe it. The song you were listening to. What is it this time? This game is so good, yo. Oh. God damn, is this game ever good. <laughs> oh no, 
the desert, you guys. There's a desert in every RPG. <sighs> Where am I? I forgive you this time. Be good for a while, okay? Wow. Raja. I will come for you. Remedy time for it. It to me if you ever really like and that you maybe even subscribe to the channel. I forget about guys, and I wish you guys the total best. Hope you guys have a freaking awesome rest of your day, and I'll see you in the next episode. So be sure to have a good one. Bye bye.